Welcome, I'm Hawaiian Shirt Papa. Sometimes with others, I visit a variety of antique, vintage, and thrift shops within Southern Ontario. Sometimes we don't get anything. Come tour with me vicariously. Hello and welcome to the tour of the Ingersoll Salvation Army Thrift Store by Hawaiian Shirt Papa. This is a, a new, new, new store to us. Um, very nice looking place. Very nicely organized as well. Um, not crowded. It does. It looks like a, just a regular retail store. I have to give kudos to, uh, to uh, most of these is thrift stores are actually of this caliber. This one's just a notch above most. There was some older glassware that Westwood Avenue was interested in, but I don't think she actually got any of those ones. There's a, a variety of little sections, as in departments. I'm gonna see these uh, interesting, I think they're Japanese, considering the town has a, uh, well, it was previously a joint venture between Suzuki and General Motors, the Kami plant just down the road from here. So it wouldn't surprise me if these were a Japanese uh, uh, set of some sort. Uh, not knowing enough about <coughs> what they do and don't do. I'm not going to try and presuppose anything on that. Interesting plate. This, it's uh, there wasn't anything of note to me, so that's uh, it just stayed here. I don't generally do ceramics. I know others do. Small appliances as usual. Bit of a sporting goods area. We go back over here and they had a lovely looking surround sound system. I didn't need another one because I have a nice one already. But this was a really nice looking one with a <clears throat> sound bar for uh, surround sound speakers and a woofer. A monitor is very often is nowadays found. Other little sets of there are at least displays of glassware and then you have all these plastics this is the I was looking to make sure I was looking at the right thing it is actually a women's section that I happen to be looking at it's right opposite those and over here we have some more hard goods and a really lovely way of displaying these interesting pillows uh, linens and sheets the children sections over there this looks like the men's these are just t-shirts or polo shirts I do take a look at some of those sometimes too uh, or that was the only thing that was even close to Hawaiian shirts so they didn't have any Hawaiian shirts at this one sad to say Took a good look though. Sometimes they're, they they go hiding in between others. That's about as close as we'll get. That was a mass market shirt. Some more children's clothes. 
uh, the women's section, more of it. Lovely display of the way their shoes are, as well as some of the accessories. Other featured bits of clothing. There's the denim. There's the... Uh, don't remember what those are. They're, oh, they're books. That's a collection of books. Uh, they look like leather bound. This is the rest of their book section. We'll be seeing more of it in just a moment go along and the other side has got this kind of thing some magazines some coffee table books novels fairly well known titles nice looking condition overall have some items that are auction they're not the not those books but those ones on the little pillar we just saw it had a a red skull kind of head on it CDs DVDs VHS kids movies there was a Something I'd been looking at above like that. Westwood Avenue did not have an interest in it, so it stayed there. She sometimes surprises me on what she's interested in, so. Some nice wall decor. Artwork, if you please, in some cases. Lots of smaller frames as well. skateboard I, I have family that are interested in skateboards um, but they already have something of that size and that vintage already some eyeglass cases they're actually really an interesting thing to obtain if you wear eyeglasses um, they are getting lousier when you get them from the optician and more expensive if you have to buy them elsewhere. A nice looking bag. That's it, folks. That's the tour of the Salvation Army Ingersoll. I hope you enjoyed this tour. It is part of a long running series. There are lots of thrift stores in Ontario. I hope you subscribe and like and choose the bell so you can get notified of the next one. I expect there may be some live videos in between. Thanks. Bye-bye.